best high school experience? Best? Man, I, I, I'm going to just, I got to tell you that most of those years, man, I was not there. Like, I, I was there, but I was so focused on where I am right now. Wow. I was not there. I did not care. I'm not going to the basketball games. I'm not, I'm going to the studio. Like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. I just didn't, I wasn't there. You already knew where you wanted to be. I, what? The light at the end of the tunnel was so bright and I just, and that, like, soon as I graduated high school, I swear to God, I said, fuck y'all. I'm out. <laughs> Pew. And I, I got on. I went to college. I went to Full Sail. I did my thing. Gone. I went for music engineering and recording arts. So, because I couldn't afford to pay for studio time. Yeah. So, slowly but surely, I collected all my equipment piece by piece and recorded all my own music. And I do that still to this day. What advice would you give to artists who want to do what you do and may not know how to pursue that? I think that if you are pursuing anything, whether it be music, film, um, TV, whatever you want to be, a skydiver, whatever, I think the most important thing is for you to be mentally, spiritually, and physically grounded over everything. I think you should absolutely know who you are before you decide to take any further steps to where, where you think you want to go. Um, I think that at the end of every day, you have to know who you are and you will not, it's important to understand this part because you will not elevate to that next level of your life until you are ready for it. And that's God's will, it's not yours. And you can go to eight colleges and do whatever you want, but until you're ready, you won't be placed there. So I think that be, be, be appreciative of the timing and do everything you can until that moment comes. Don't force it because it's something that you could regret. Um, this industry ain't for everybody. It's not for everybody. Um, everybody can't take it. So like I said, you need to mentally be grounded. You need to be spiritually connected and in tune with yourself and our higher power, you know, and physically work on your craft. Get right. If you play ball, you need to be in that gym every day. Get right, get ready, hitting the wind sprints, make sure you're conditioning. If you're doing music, condition, you need to be in the studio, you need to write, you need to practice melody, practice structure. You know, if you're a painter, practice your steady hand. If you're a barber, practice your skills, like condition yourself, you know. Um, and that's really it. It's really, I can't really say, I can't speak for any particular career path, but just in life, period, whatever you want to do, just know that you're not going to get there until you're ready. And that's it. That's, that's a real life knowledge. <laughs> that's all I got. Message. That's all I got. That's the message for the day.